Hello, my name is Dr Laura William and I'm an Associate Professor in Employment Relations and Equality and I'm the Director of the Diversity Interest Group at the University of Greenwich. The Diversity Interest Group is a pan-university research group which brings together academics from across all four faculties. The interdisciplinary and cross-disciplinary focus of the Diversity Interest Group means that DIG is able to produce research that is not only novel and focusing on current issues, but addresses problems from multiple perspectives. The University of Greenwich Diversity Interest Group is a vibrant and active research group. Not only do we bring academics together from across all four faculties at the University of Greenwich, but we also encourage engagement with wider stakeholders. We have industry partners, and we also partner with academics from across the academic community in the UK and abroad. For example, in October of this year, we held a seminar on decolonising the curriculum, where we welcomed academics from the University of Manchester and the Open University. In addition to frequent webinars where we invite external guests, we have internal events where we showcase our own research, and each year we have an annual conference. The annual conference this year focused on contemporary issues in equality and diversity. We welcomed academics from across the globe, as well as presenting work from the University of Greenwich. Academics were presenting on topics relating to law, education, the media, the arts and business. It was a very good time to spend together to interrogate our own research and also plan for research going forward. Overall then, our research aim at the University of Greenwich Diversity Interest Group is to bring together academics from all four faculties to engage in cross-disciplinary research on equality and diversity issues. Other research that has been carried out at the Diversity Interest Group includes work on microaggressions and how these manifest amongst social interactions in relation to women. We've also had projects that look at how to decolonise the curriculum and to close the um, black and ethnic minority attainment gap. And we've had projects that look at stigma and how this manifests itself for disabled people. These are just some examples of the work that's been carried out at DIG and examples of the way that DIG is going forward in the future to continue exploring these themes in more depth. One project that was funded by an external funder, the British Academy and Leverhulme Trust, was a project carried out by myself and Professor Wim van der Kirkover. In this project, we examined employment tribunal judgments. Those claims where whistleblowing was made in combination with discrimination. This project resulted in not only academic publications, but also lay reports. These lay reports were made in collaboration with industry partners such as Equality and Employment Law Centre. These reports have had an impact in the real world, often cited in the media such as Personnel Today and the Financial Times. Hello, my name's Dr Louise Hewitt. I'm a senior lecturer in the School of Law and Criminology and Deputy Director of the Diversity Interest Group. My research as part of DIG, the Diversity Interest Group, is into disability hate crime. I started um, looking at this as a research study back in 2013 and received um, funding, successful funding bids to the Higher Education Innovation Fund, where I was able to take part in a knowledge exchange with the Metropolitan Police Service to look at six London boroughs and how the police identify and record disability hate crime. I've received a second round of funding from the same fund where um, the initial study was so successful and this has now been extended to look at the identification and recording of disability hate crime across 32 London boroughs.